Shlam Amchun. This is going to be a reading of the book Karyana Suryaya Al Sudra Kadmaya Sharwaya, which is a book that's actually written in Eastern and Western uh, scripts. So uh, I'm going to read it going from the top. Drasha Kadmaya Alap. And the three words here mean house, dog, and flower. Beta Kelba Warda. Kelba Warda Beta. Warda Beta Kelpa. So my purpose is that you can hit pause, figure out some words, hit play, and have me read them. Uh, so if you're just starting out, that can give you a little bit of correction. And you can use this tool. You're going to have to interact with it by using that play pause button uh, to uh, shut me up. Give yourself some chance to sound out a word, maybe write out a word, and then uh, hit play and hear it. Uh, so and that also helps me keep the video shorter. So let's keep on going. Drasha Treyana Beth Tara Erya Gemla. Arya Gamla Tara Gamla Tara Arya. So you notice that because it's page three, it's got a Gemel, page four has a Dalet. You see, they're mixing the two scripts nicely. Drasha Tlithaya Gamal. Drasha Tlithaya Gamal. Shimsha Numra Umra. Nimra, Imra, Shimsha. Imra, Shimsha, Nimra. Adrasha, Ruiaya. Dibba, Pinna, Lippa. So Dibba is under bear, Pinna is under the Pinna, the nest, and Lippa is under the heart. Line two. Kinna libba dibba. Libba dibba pinna. Drasha khmishaya. Right to left. The fish, nuna, the mountain, tora, and the chalkboard. Lucha. Next line. Tora, lucha, nuna. Lucha Nuna Tura Drasha Shtithaya So a female or a cow, I guess they're always female in English. Torta monkey Opa and like a a large vase. Koka Kopa Koka Torta Koka Torta Kopa. Rock, kepa, a head, resha, and an egg, baita. Kepa, resha, baita, resha, baita, kepa, baita, kepa, resha. A rooster, dika, an elephant, pila, raven, zira. Dika pila zira pila zira dika dika zira dika pila like most of these these words have been presented but I'll translate them beta house shimsha sun kalba dog numra tiger warda Flower, Imra, like a sheep. Kalba, dog, Numra, Warda, Imra, Beta, Shimsha, son. Warda, Imra, Beta, Shimsha, Kalba, Numra. Tara, door, Dibba, Arya, Kinna, Gamla, camel, Libba. Arya, Kinna, 
غملا لبا ترعا دبا غملا لبا ترعا دبا اريا قنا فش نونا كيبا طورا ريشا لوخا بيثا طورا ريشا لوخا بيثا نونا كيبا لوخا بيثا نونا كيبا طورا ريشا تورتا ديكا قوبا بيلا قوكا زيرا قوبا بيلا قوكا زيرا تورتا ديكا قوكا زيرا تورتا ديكا قوبا بيلا So a note about uh, the differences between the Western Ma'arwai and the Eastern Madan Chaya pronunciation, and it has to also do with the vowels, is that we are phonemically more rich, the Eastern is, so we have two O vowels. So we have the U sound and the O sound. The Western puts both into one. So you don't know, looking at this, if it would be a dot on top or a bottom of the wall, because they would always pronounce it. Turta. So here it should be torta, but looking at it as a Western would write it, it says torta. So all, the best dictionaries always use um, estrangula. Well, it doesn't matter which alphabet you use, but they use Eastern vowels. Um, that's what makes Sokolov's dictionary very good. Um, also with Tuma Audo, because they're getting that. It's a bit of a, a nerdy point. Um, most Easterners also pronounce a lot of their O's as U's. So you, you hear paroka, the Savior said as paruka. Um, but it would look wrong to someone who knows how to write really well, whether you put the dot on, a, on top as an O or the dot on the bottom as a U. So if you know how torta is supposed to be written, someone wrote torta, you would notice they wrote it wrong. Um, but again, in the Western, it makes no difference. They have that one symbol for both. So, same thing. Qopa, here's written. And I would read it, if I'm looking at this, probably as a qopa. Unless I know the word, is qopa. Um, so, there, there's one big problem with the, uh, with the Western, is if you want to write correctly in Eastern, you need a dictionary that has um, the Eastern Vowels. I mean, for dictionaries, I, I would say you gotta use Eastern vowels. Beta Rabba, so a large house. Warda Shapira, so a handsome flower. Tura Rama. Warda Shapira, Tura Rama, Beta Rabba. Tura Rama, Beta Rabba, Warda Shapira. Drashad Arbasar Libba Sapya, so a clean heart, pure heart. Awa Rahima, a beloved father. Imma Rahimtha, so that's the feminine form for Imma, mother. Imma is mother. Awa Rahima, Imma Rahimtha, Libba Sapya. Imma Rahimtha, Libba Sapya. Open door. Tara Pthicha. So like a um, barking dog. Kalba Sricha. A powerful lion. Arya Ashina. Tara Pthicha. Kalba Sricha. أريا عشينا كلب صريخة أريا عشينا ترأبتيخة أريا عشينا ترأبتيخة كلب صريخة دراشد إشتعصر إمرة تميمة بير بسيمة I'm sorry 
Imra Tamima is like um, a gentle lamb. Pera Basime. So a pera is a fruit, and it cannot be used in singular for plural. Pera Basima, pleasant fruit. And a Qinna Tashya. So a hidden Qinna um, nest. Umra Tamima, Pera Basima, Qinna Tashya. Pera Basima, Qinna Tashya, Imra Tamima. Inna Tashya Imra Basima Pera Basima Imra Tamima I'm sure the Imra would also be very Basima which would be tasty so I'll go back here Inna Tashya Imra Tamima Pera Basima a little fish Nuna Zarta so remember what I said about those vowels here I don't know if it's Nona or Nuna and I don't know if it's Urta or Zarta unless I know the grammatical rules. So in grammar, probably many lessons in the future, I'll show you when you use each. And it's very easy once you figure that out. Um, so hope's not lost if you don't know it, but I like the dots to be there. You know, about that, I'm an Eastern purist. Nuna, Zara, Lucha, Okama, so a blackboard. Lucha Okama. Okama's black. So Abgar, the king of Edessa, was Okama, the black. Torta Sumakta. So she is a ruddy or red um, cow. Torta Sumakta. Nuna Saora Lucha Okama Torta Sumakta. Lucha Okama Torta Sumakta. Nuona Saora. Torta Sumakta. Nuona Saora. Lucha Ukama. So Twira is broken. This that old Koka. There's Koka Twira. Dika Garoya. The calling rooster. Dika. Dika Garoya. And the white egg. Baeta Khawarta. Dika Karoya, Baeta Khawartha, Koka, Twira, Twira. So it's a T W sound, Twira. Baeta Khawartha, Koka, Twira, Dika Karoya. Drashid, that Shaasar. So that's that Shaasar. Shimshad Nach. So it's the sun rises. It, um, it's the same verb we use for theophany. So phaneo in Greek. It, it shines forth. So the sun rises. Shimsha dnach. The camel ate herb, greenery. Gamla ichal gilla. The elephant lives in the jungle. Pila chaye ba'awa. So chaye is the verb to live. Pila chaye ba, the word for jungle, awa. Shemshad nach yamla echal gilla pila chaye ba'awa. Shemsha tnach tnach shemsha. Makes no difference. Yamla echal gilla. Echal gamla gilla. Pila chayeb awa. Chaye pila awa. Gamla echal gilla. Pila chayeb awa. Shimshad nach. Gamla echal gilla. Drashat isri. Talia kamin shentha. The young boy rose from sleep. From his rest. Talia kam min shinta. Izzal, he went. Izzal talmida, the disciple, the student. Izzal talmida, lam madrashta, to the house of learning. So, madrashta. Notice that you have dalat reshin here, drash, and you have drasha. 
So a lesson is drasha, and the place where you are made to do your drasha is madrashta. Yosef Ktau, so Joseph wrote, Yosef Ktau, Kenya. Now you'll notice on the Western here, there's a difference. Yosef is Yod, Skapa, Wow. In the Western, changed the Skapa to Abtacha, and that's because they have a vowel shift. So they would read Skapa as an O. So that would be Yo. It would be strange. So they oftentimes, when you have an A W diphthong in the original, Ow, they will preserve it by reducing Skapa to Abtacha. So Oftentimes, when you see a ptacha before a wa or a yud in, in the Western script, in the Eastern, it will have been in a skapa <clears throat> because of their tendency to read that skapa as an o. So, drashad asrin taliyaka min shintha izzal talmida al madrashta yosep kthau bqenya. Bqenya is a read, and here he uses a pin. Kenya. Is al Talmid al Madrashta? Yosep Kthao Kenya. Yosep Kthao Kenya. Talia Kamin Shinta. Is al Talmid al Madrashta. Al Madrashta. Drash al Aisrin Ukhad. Al Melpan al Sodra. So Al is to enter. The entry room, some people may know, it's called the Maaltha. The, uh, the entry room, or the entrance of Christ. So, Eret Ushan is sometimes called Ma'alta Mara. So, the entrance of our Lord into the city. So, Al is to enter. It's also the word for on. Um, but Al as a verb is to enter. Al Melpana, the teacher entered. Al Sidra. Notice, speakers of modern, that it's not Rabi. We wouldn't say Rabi, we'd say Melpana. Um, Darshana, because it's that's his job there. That's a bit more of a precise word. Al Malpana al Sidra, Maryam Kithbath. So that was interesting. We had right before this, Yosef Kthau. Joseph wrote, but Maryam Kithbath. Mary wrote. So the masculine, which is actually the the dictionary form of the verb, the, the kind of the simplest form is consonant, consonant, a consonant, kap, tau, taha, be, thou. For the feminine, it's ath ending, so a t h, ath, kithbath. So if she if she if she killed someone, she it would be. Kotlath. Maryam Kithbath Drasha. What did she write? Her Drasha. What's her Drasha? It's what we're doing now. It's a lesson. Drasha right up here. Telmida. So the student. Sha'e. So Sha'e is to play. Bodarta. So now we see this is this kind of continuous present tense. Sha'e. It's the Skapa Zlama for the present tense. We use that in modern. Right? We'll say tale, achel, bachet. Um, and so the root is a bit more pure, sha'e. So he is playing madarta in the yard. So I'll just do this again. Drash the Aisrin Uchad. Al Melpan al Sodra. Maryam Kithbat Drasha. Talmina sha'e madarta. Maryam Kithba Drasha, Talmida Sha'ib Darta, Al Melpana Sodra, Talmida Sha'ib Darta, Maryam Kithba Drasha, Drashat Isrin Wadtrain, Aprim, so that's Ephraim, like the, the saint, but also Ephraim, who's got his bathrobe on his left arm. Aprim Lawish, so it's a lot like Sha'e Katil Lawish, so Lemet Beth Shim Shin has to do with putting on something, 
Lameth Beth Sheen. Think of your verbs that way. You know, your your roots. Eprim Lawish Kutina. So Kutina, it's connected word for cotton, Kitana. Kutina. It's the simple white shirt. Shoshan. Shalcha. So Susanna. Shalcha. She takes off. Msane. So msane. They're the slippers. Msane. Sargon Aho Rumana. So Rumana. Rumana. The Roman fruit. The pomegranate. Sergon Aho Rumana. And notice they want to say Sergon. They don't want to say Sergun. So they would put a Skapa. Because where we would say Achel, they would say Ochel or Ochel. In here, it's Sargon, and they made it past its Echel. And they have to put that O sound that way to get the sound of Sargon out. Drash, the Eistrin with Lata. So, lesson of 20 and 3, 23. Of 20 and 3. The Eistrin with Lata. Gaura Shate Maya. So, Man drinks water. Bartha, the girl. So Bar would be a son. So Bartha was a girl. Sarqa, Sa'ara. So Shate is the masculine present or continuous form. And then Sarqa is the feminine. So if we're saying she is drinking, we'd say Bartha Shatya. Or if he is combing, it would be Gaura Sarq. So it's that two dots in the top and two below. And the first letter of the root, two on the sky, skapa, long A. And on the second letter, a long E. And for the feminine, it becomes first letter, long A. Second letter, third letter, long A. Alat. Right? So you can put in like, kap, tau, be, it will be ketwa. Kop, tet, lemet, it will be katla. But kap tau bet would be ka til. Kop tet lemet would be ka tov. Nuna sahe nahra. The fish swims in the river. Nuna sahe nahra. Nuna sahe nahra. Berta serka sahra. That means her hair, that he, the end, saying that it's hers. Gaura shat maya. Sergon Achel Rumana, Shoshan Shel Hamsane, Eprim Lawish Kotina, Nuna Sahe Nara, Bartha Serka Sara, Gaura Shate Maya, Sergon Achel Rumana, Shel Hat Shushan Msane, Eprim Lawish Kotina. Drashad Asrin Warpa Nushra. So I would think of it as a hawk, but this looks kind of vulture like to me. It's a good book. Can't vouch for that hawk. Nushra Khatap. Khatap is to snatch something. Um, like, you know, when you can kill it. Khatap. Supra. So a bird. Nushra Khatap Supra. Talia tarab to beat. Tarab al tara. So on the door. Lita, so a female uh, girl. We have Talia, we have Lita. Lita ta'na qatu, she takes the cat. Al kathpa on her shoulder. So she carries the cat on her shoulder. Lita ta'na qatu al kathpa. Sayana, Sayada, the hunter. Azil, he goes. Al Seda, Ukatal, Tawia. So the hunter goes hunting and he kills. And he kills uh, the deer. Tlita, Tana, Katu, Al Kathpa. The girl carries the cat on her shoulder. Talia tara al tara. The boy strikes the door. Nushra khatab supra. 
the um, hawk snatches the bird. Sayada azil sayada qatal tawya. So he goes hunting. The hunter hunts, and he kills the deer, like especially European roe deer.